King and traffic having no problem negotiating in the Catrata Law. Time saver traffic. Well, it is not just world class golf that the Solheim Cup will bring to Toledo, but thousands of fans from all around the world will be visiting the Glass City as well. And there are some big plans to celebrate. 13 ABC's Ashley Bornanson live downtown with the details on that. Good morning. Sasham, good morning. Right now, we might be the only ones here at Promenade Park, but soon, come September 3rd, 30,000 people are expected to be pouring in, filling the streets of Toledo, and that includes not only Toledoans, but our out of state and European guests as well. The, the downtown area will be activated with so much to celebrate in Prometica's Fan Fest celebrations, kicking off the Solheim Cup tournament celebrations right here. There will be live bands, art alleys, food trucks, a champagne float area, and so much more. There will also be nine screens spread throughout the downtown area so you can watch the ceremony from just about anywhere you go. The Fan Fest will also include 25 local restaurants with elevated menus, a large bar built over the fountain in Levis Square Park, local live art expositions and more. After a tough year, Prometica reps tell me that this will ignite not only the Toledo in spirit but also will be a major boost to our local economy. The economic impact for the community is well over $32 million, so in just two short weeks, it's amazing. Uh, just think that we, can, we do this one well, and who knows what's ahead of us. The Prometica team tells me they are so excited to prove to the world what Toledo can do and how they can host this incredible celebration for the world to see. That celebration kicks off Friday at 2 p.m. with those activities all night long. And of course, we've got that big headliner that's Gwen Stefani performing at night right here at the Promenade Park and also a major fireworks celebration. And of course, for all those country fans out there, you've got Chris Young performing Saturday night. All those tickets can still be found at promenadeconcerts.com. There's still general admission available that starts at 30 bucks and some VIP seating, but it's only standing room only now, so you're going to want to get those tickets fast. Of course, we'll have all those details at 13abc.com. Reporting live from Toledo, Ashley Bornans in 13abc Action News. So as we've established, the Solheim Cup is a global event that is going to attract people from multiple countries, but remember, currently the U.S. has a travel ban.